Hello guys, in this video we will see how to download and install Ubuntu Server 24.10 on VirtualBox. First go to Ubuntu official website. Ubuntu 24.10 Paracular Oriel is now available for download. So click on get Ubuntu, then click on server, then get Ubuntu server. See, the first one is 24.04 LTS and if you scroll down, see here we have the Ubuntu 24.10 and this is the server, server edition. If you scroll down, see, its size is 2 gigabytes. We can just click on download or select alternative downloads, then select the torrent down, torrent for 24.10. This is bit faster than normal download. So select either either of them and click on torrent for 24.10. Torrent link has been downloaded. Go to downloads. Click on this torrent link. Then here it will be added. See I have already downloaded the Ubuntu 24.10 server ISO. In your case wait until download completes. Once download is completed, then open virtual box. Down. See, I have already Oracle VM virtual box. If you want to install Oracle VM virtual box on your machine, then go through the link provided in the video description and install it. Open it. This is the only virtual machine on virtual box. So, to create new virtual machine, you have to click on new or machine and select new. Both are same. Select new. Then provide the name. See, this is the name for the virtual machine. Okay. So then select the folder to store this virtual machine files and folders. You can drop down, select other. Then select the path where you have the NS space. Click on new folder, paste it, hit enter, select folder, then select the ISO image that we have downloaded. Click on drop down, select other, then select the Ubuntu 24.10 server ISO file. Click on open, then see here, it automatically selected Linux and version as Ubuntu 64 bit. Then select this skip unattended installation, which means we are going, if you don't select, it will install it automatically. So if you select this skip unattended installation, OS will be installed manually. So click on next. Here provide the memory. Base memory default it has selected 2 gigabytes. So I am giving 4 gigabytes with the number of processors. Then click on next. Provide RDF size. I am giving 100 gigabytes. Then click on next. See, this is the summary of the virtual machine. Click on finish. Still, if you want edit settings of this virtual machine, select it here and click on settings. Or right click and select the settings. Okay. Now, if you are okay with these settings, click on start virtual machine. Or right click, select start, then normal start. Both options are same. Okay, so click on start. Maximize it. Use up and down arrows and select the first option that is try or install Ubuntu server and hit enter. Now select the language, I am going with English and hit enter. Then select keyboard layout, language English, US and variant also I am going with same. So use the tab to come down or use up and down arrows to come, to come down to the done and hit enter. Now by default it has selected Ubuntu server. 
see here we have the two options ubuntu server and ubuntu server minimizer so i am going with default ubuntu server then search for third party softwares keep the cursor wherever see here it is blinking and select that space bar to select and click go to the done and hit enter see this is the networking network configuration information i am okay with the default one so Help done and hit enter. I don't, I don't want to provide any proxy address now. So keep blank and hit done. Then select continue and hit enter. See now build storage configuration. Okay, I'm going with the default one. That is use entire disk and select done and hit enter. See this is the file system summary i'm okay with that one so select done and hit enter continue now we have to create the user so i'm giving username as r schools then provide the server name server name i'm giving ub2410 vm okay pk username see this is user full name now here we have to provide user name after schools, provide the password for this user. Select done and hit enter. If you want to install open SSH, select install SSH, then select done. See, no third party drivers applicable. Okay. Select continue and hit enter. See, if you want to select any one of these features like Docker, AWS CLI, and Google Cloud SDK, and we have the many more options like Prometheus and all. Okay. Select them and done. See, installation has been started. This may take time. I will resume whenever. We need to reboot the Ubuntu Linux 24.10 server virtual machine. See, installation is completed. Now we have to reboot the Ubuntu server. So select reboot now and hit enter. Now provide the username that we have created, provide the password of this user, see we have successfully logged in, control it to clear screen, now verify the version more slash etc os hyphen release, see we have installed Ubuntu 24.0 server edition, in this video we have seen how to download and install Ubuntu Server 24.10 Server Edition on VirtualBox. For more Linux tutorials, please subscribe my channel. Thank you.